talking about this new district wide plan from CMS to tackle Title IX uh, harassment claims from Myers Park High School students over the, the, the year. They're wanting to make sure students are supported through whatever they have been claiming over uh, the, the course of on campus situations. They come up with this awareness campaign and they're going to be putting posters all around the school district um, in schools, outside of schools to really give some safety tips when it comes to this situation. They're going to pass out a CMS safety letter starting at the beginning of the school year. This letter will contain on how to report sexual harassment and discrimination. It will also appoint a campus liaison for each school school so students will be able to have a point person to go to. There's also going to be training on Title IX and sexual harassment and discrimination starting with staff through now through the 24th. High school students within the first 10 days of the upcoming school year and then elementary school, middle school within the first 20 days. They also have a plan for parents. Take a listen. But in addition to reporting, the department is also responsible for ensuring that all CMS staff know how to respond and how to respond appropriately when they receive such a report. All right, parents will also be included in this Title IX plan to help students and staff kind of all bridge the gap together. There is a report from CMS, which is why this plan was created. It was uh, following the 2018-2019 school year where more than 1,600 sexual harassment claims were reported. So this is why this is being in place right now ahead of the new school year. And lastly, they have a Title IX task force in place to go over what's going to happen this year with the new plan and then to be able to tackle next year and to make sure everything is following in line. All right, Ruby, thank you.